What's up, YouTube? How you guys doing today? I hope you guys are fabulous, of course. So, as you guys can read what this title is below, it is my favorites for the month of August. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you do not miss out on awesome videos like this. So, let's get right on in to it. So, for the month of August, if you guys don't know, it's my birthday month, of course. I am a Leo. I was born on August 8th. Random fact about me, of course. Um, so, a lot of you guys that subscribe to me definitely gave me that birthday shout out. And I definitely want to say thank you so much for, you know, helping me bring in my birthday and giving me that love. Because, you know, I love to be loved. Everybody loves to be loved. <laughs> but anyways, other than my birthday month... Um, my social media platforms has definitely grown a lot. I am so happy and so thankful for every one of you, each and every one of you guys that come and watch my channel and check me out, of course. Other than that, I'm not going to cry and give a big old spiel. I'm just going to jump right into the video. So let's go ahead and get into what has been my favorite for this month. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to start off with skincare. Skincare is really easy. It's only one particular product. Um, I've broken out into some type of weird patchy phase or whatever the case may be and I needed something that's going to bounce my skin completely right back. So I reached for my holy grail and that is the Origins Original Skin uh, Facial Mask with Rose Clay. This helps retexture your skin instantly like of course it's very drying and then you will see like the porous situation like you know clay mask of course but this one helps retexture your skin if you have problematic skin and acne skin this is amazing for you let's jump on into the major major portion of my favorites which is of course cosmetics so i'm going to talk about a couple of items that has been my favorite or my holy grail of course for the whole month of august and the first product i want to talk about is my press powder that i've been using to contour my skin and that is the black radiance press powder in ebony um you guys see me feature this product so many times on my youtube channel because i really didn't have a product to contour my skin extremely well of course i have the nika k dual contour powders and those are good as well too but i have to like work out a system to be able to contour my skin super duper well this gets my contour packed down honey i don't have to stress out about how i'm going to contour my skin what's going to contour my skin this contours my skin all the time so i am amazed by it there's another product in this this favorites that's also from black radiance so that should tell you guys that drugstore products is amazing as well too so don't be afraid to start there the next item is the soft focus finishing powder from black radiance as well too in the color milk chocolate this gets everything smooth when i bake with my rcma powder this helps Kick off that bake, smooth out the foundation, and give me the right color. Nevertheless, it just it just makes everything look smooth and like a fine focus. So this is good to sweep off powder from baking if you guys do that. Or better yet, if you need to set your foundation, this is amazing to set your foundation as well too. The only con I have about this is that it's very, very, very powdery. If you're okay with that, it works. I'm okay with it. And it works. The next two items, I kind of skipped over it. I should have started with those first, then that it's the major step of getting a flawless application. And those are primers. I'm going to be talking about two primers that I use together. So if they ever came like packaged together, that'll be amazing. But of course they're not because they're the Makeup Forever Step 1 Equalizer Primer in Mattifying and Nourishing. Um, of course they're separate, but I like to mix them together. I have combination skin. But yet, I still like to have a nice, dewy, satinish looking finish. So, I mix these two together. The mattifying will keep my oil at bay. Also, I hear anything to the skin amazing. And then the nourishing one will give me that nice, hydrated look, but yet a filtered look because it's mixed with that mattifying one. I don't know if I'm sounding crazy, but that's how 
this application is able to be looking flawless 100 percent of the time is because i mix these two primers together all right so the next item i'm going to talk about is what's on my lip i'm pretty sure you guys are wondering like oh my god nico i never seen you with like a cool tone lip it just looks crazy out of the box that's the purpose i'm now trying to step more out of the box and being more acceptant of color so i reached to the back of my kit and i found some lip glosses that i've never used before so here's the two lip glosses these are from the stephen klein lip collection it's two lip glosses the first pinky color is called fast life and the purple color is called provoke these are amazing i love the lip wand so these two lip colors, they've been sitting in the back of my kit ever since the Stephen Klein collection kind of ended. Fastlane definitely reminds me so much of Orgasm if it was a darker complexion. And of course, Provoke is, is a really cool, beautiful purple. Again, I am in love with these lip wands. These lip wands are to die for. I wish NARS lip glosses all came like this lip wand here. The last item that's in the whole cosmetics, beauty, makeup realm is my favorite um, setting spray and that is the Sephora Collection Beauty Amplifier Setting Spray. This setting spray is amazing because it has lemon to help refine your skin and pores. Also peppermint to help with inflammation and if your skin feels kind of like irritated to soothe it. And it's only $16. Who don't want a setting spray for $16? I mean, the one ounce of the Urban Decay is $16. This is a 2.7 ounce. So, pick it up. And it's on the hot now in the front of the store. So, of course, <laughs> I had to pick up too. So, the last item I want to talk about is my favorite fragrance. This is from Avon. Yes, I shop at Avon. And this is the Perceived for Men at Avon. This is a citrus based fragrance. It has citrus and tangerine. Um, it was only 20 bucks and it's a 3.4 ounce. Like this is a lot to go through and I barely put a major dent in it for the month of August. Um, it was a birthday gift for my mom. My mom loves shopping at Avon. Shout out to you mom. You got me an awesome fragrance for 23 bucks. Um, I had to definitely do my research on this before I started spraying it, and this is bomb.com. Alright guys, so that concludes the video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed every little favorite that I talked about. If you guys have been using any of these products that I have mentioned in my favorites, leave it in the comment section down below so we can start a dialogue, of course. And I hope to see you guys at the next one. Don't be afraid to be a part of the Freedom Army. Again, my name is Nico, and it has been my pleasure to sit here with you guys. Until next time, peace out.